Today is uh, the 1st of January, 2024. Happy New Year to everyone. Happy New Year. So, since today is 2024, the start of the year, so what is in store? What is new for the City of God ministry? Okay, so first off, since we are already at, at the beginning of January of this year, 2024, um, this marks the start of the National Bible Month for this year. And uh, what does the Seed of God ministry have is that we have a Bible raffle. We, we are doing a Bible raffle for, um, for, for, the, for, the, for the faithful. We are doing this Bible raffle because at the start of this year, the City of God ministry, uh, we had... We, uh, we already had an agreement with the Archdiocese of Manila and so we are fixing, we are coordinating with the different vicariates within the Archdiocese uh, schedules so that we could already start the Bible exposition to every vicariates for this year of 2024. So stay tuned, stay tuned everyone for the details for the respective schedules in the different vicariates here in the Archdiocese of Manila. Hopefully, we will be starting this month and we will be telling you, we will, we will be informing you of where we will start. And so, for everyone who already availed of our Bible raffle tickets, okay, so we uh, we invite you to, to hopefully you could already remit at, at the beginning of this year, of this month, maybe first and second week of January, so that we could already collate the necessary funds that we will be needing for the start of the vicariat journey of the Bible exposition that we will be doing here in the Archdiocese of Manila. Also, secondly, we will be resuming also our Bible exposition every Saturday in Pope Pius, all right, in Pope Pius, and it will be the same schedule still, one thirty to three thirty in the afternoon. Hopefully, you could you could join us in either of these services, but we encourage you to attend our Bible exposition. This is life changing. This will change um, your life in a good way. I promise you that your life will change for the better, and. Uh, also in this raffle, you'll be, you'll you'll have a chance to win um, imported Bibles, Bibles, Bibles from the Holman publisher, like the Adorn Bible. That will be our grand prize, by the way. And also we have other Bibles sent to us, sponsored by uh, Totus Bookstore, in uh, Geroff Henry C, and also. We have Bibles from Elmer of the PCBS, the Philippine Christian Bookstore. And uh, yeah, we encourage you to get in touch with them if you have Bible needs for, your, for, your, for yourself or for your community. We encourage you to get Bibles from them. They're very nice people. And in any case, also, uh, we will be continuing our... Uh, yes, for the entire year, we'll still have our Bible in Focus, which is our Bible in Focus live every Wednesday. And also, what's new with the City of God ministry? Now I'll tell you. Every Saturday evening, we also have our devotions and talks on St. Joseph with the MMSJ, the Merciful Missionaries. Merciful Missionaries of St. Joseph. This is a community, a seminary of um, Cardinal Advincula, and this this community is uh, I think it's headed it's headed by Father Prex Fajardo, a friend of our Cardinal of our dear Cardinal, and we are always in touch with Father Prex. So every Saturday we we have been doing this talk about Saint Joseph. Now, what's good about this is we are already done with the Litany of St. Joseph. We have compiled all the manuscripts that I wrote, and we will be putting that together into a 
one whole manuscript, a book, this would be, this material would be made into a book. Now, this, is, this would be a grand project for the City of God Ministry having a published material in collaboration with Father Prex with the MMSJ. Now, if you're interested to avail this copy, now, hopefully, because this will go in support of the community of the Merciful Missionaries of St. Joseph. Now, if you avail of these copies, and we encourage you already, so it, this, it, this material will help you learn about Josephology, the study of St. Joseph. And after that, there are a few projects that we are still doing with, with the community that I cannot open up in public yet. But stay tuned, there are more projects that the City of God Ministry can do for the entire Catholic community. And uh, lastly, we, we would like also to remind you, uh, it is really important to dive into the Word, to get into the Word of God. There is nothing more important than the Bible. Now what we do here, what we did here in, in our devotion to St. Joseph, this is a biblical exegesis of St. Joseph. This is a deeper knowledge, a deeper, a deeper dive. So it means that every, every, every chance that we get, every chance that we get, as much as possible, we ground. Because in all the traditions of the Catholic Church, in all the traditions, it is always recorded, written, so in part of the scriptures, everything is also written. That is why we encourage everyone to stay grounded in scripture, to have your faith renewed by the word. I know that it would be hard reading the scriptures. And oftentimes, I've heard people uh, telling me how hard it is to understand. Yes, they could read the Bible, but... It's hard to understand. That's why we encourage you to, to take part in our, in our Bible exposition. We help you understand. So, by expositing every verse, we expound every verse so that you would have that experience, that powerful experience of change, life transforming. You'll have that. So, by the start of this year, we, we would like to... To put that into you, we would like to put that into you, that may your year be blessed, may your year be blessed by getting in touch with the Lord. Now, we, uh, if you have any more questions, if you have any more questions, please feel free to contact us. Uh, through our cell phone number, which will, which will be posted at the description of this video. And also, all, we would be happy if you follow us, if you click on like, subscribe, whatever, comment, in our, um, both in our YouTube channel, join us, subscribe to us, and also follow us in our Facebook page, The City of God Ministry. We'd like to hear from you from these channels and uh, hopefully all your comments will be heard and our online presence would grow but it does not change the fact that our fellowship is done face to face because congregation congregational worship the Bible exposition it is best served if people gather together with the real presence because we will be having we will be celebrating the Eucharist and nothing beats having the Eucharist physically all right so again happy new year everyone take care and see you soon God bless